happening? Krishna is sitting and eating dirt. And Balaram runs to Mother Yashoda. And he tells Mother Yashoda, Krishna is eating dirt. Now the Acharyas are giving different reasons why Balaram went and complained. One out of that is, Balaram knew that Krishna has come to reduce the burden of Mother Earth, but he didn't know this is the way he's going to do it. <laughs> By eating dirt with both hands. He went to Mother Yashoda to say, I know he's Prithvi Bhara Nashara Mukundaha. He has come to reduce the burden of Mother Earth. But if this is the way he's going to do it, by eating mud with both his hands, it's not good for him. Huh? And at the same time, Balaram had a problem because when you touch someone's property once, it's okay. Twice, it's okay. Three times, then it's a problem. Balaram as Ananta Shesh holds Mother Earth on his head. First time, the Lord touched Mother Earth as Varahadev. Balram said, okay, no problem. <laughs> Second time the Lord touched Mother Earth as Vamandev with his feet. <laughs> Balram said, no problem. Now this time he's getting too much. <laughs> Third time. So he went to Mother Yashoda to complain. You know. yeah. Three times, it's a big offense. <laughs> Mother Yashoda comes there with a stick in her hand. And with her left hand, she holds the right hand of Krishna. And she's not asking, did you eat or no? Kasman Murda Madan Tatman Bhavan Bhakshitavan. Why did you eat? And Krishna is saying, Me? Ah, Bhavan Bhakshitavan, you. Now Krishna is not saying any of this with his mouth. Because if he opens his mouth to speak, he just ends up proving his point wrong. Because the mouth is filled with mud and dirt. So with his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Very expressive eyes, dancing eyebrows and eyes. So he says, me? Mother Yashoda says, yes, you, Bhavan Bhakshitavan, you ate. Krishna says with his eyes, actually, Mother, my principle is whatever I eat, I share with my friends. <laughs> so if I have eaten, they have eaten. And if they have not eaten, I have not eaten. <laughs> Mother Yashoda says, Rahaha. You have sat alone and ate. You didn't share it with them. Krishna says, Acha, confidentially? Then how do you know? <laughs> Mother Yashoda says, Vadanti, they came and told me. Till now the gopis had complained. This was the turning point where the gopas are complaining. So Vadanti, they came and complained. Krishna says, Tavaka yete. You know, they're after all your team. Gopis, right? So your Sajatiya. Strilingi Sajatiya Sangha. They are ultimately your camp. So, <coughs> Mother Yashoda says, No, Tavaka, your team. <laughs> Krishna says, Is it? Ete, yes, indeed, your team. Krishna says, Kumara. Bache. <laughs> they are all kids. <laughs> Mother Yashoda says, Bache, manke, sache. You know, in Shastra it's described, anyone less than five years old, whatever he speaks is Veda Vakya, because they will not lie. So Mother Yashoda is saying they are all two, three years old and they are speaking and you are saying that they are lying? Krishna says, yes, they are all lying. Mother Yashoda says, Agraja api etadvadati. Even your older brother complained. Now Krishna is in a fix. If he says, Balram is also lying, oh, that is Maryada Vyatikraman, he is going against etiquette to superior Vaishnavas. <laughs> but if he says, yes, what Balram is saying is correct, but then that proves his point wrong. So he tells his mother. Mother, I want to tell you something. So drama begins right here. <laughs> I want to tell you something, Mother. <coughs> what is it, Krishna? All of this with mouth closed. Actually, I don't know how this person has become my brother. <laughs> I have some serious differences with him. Krishna is two, two years old. Mother Yashoda says, differences? Okay, go ahead.